Tanu Mene. That's right. No, I don't have a Malayali accent all the time. Sorry. <laughs> no, I'm coming to Dubai. Yeah. Of course, I'm willing to be interviewed. But my only requirement is that the interview should be Malayali and a Menon. <laughs> it's in the contract. Don't you read it? Okay. <laughs> it should be hard. It shouldn't be hard to find one. It's Dubai. Come on, I'm coming home. It's my motherland. It's my native place. <laughs> okay then. Toodles. See you soon. Hi, Anu. Hi, I'm Lekha. Lekha what? Menon? <laughs> sure. You don't have any girl here. No children to worry means you cannot be Malayali. But I'm in Dubai. And I'm from Kerala. Palakkad. So you're a visiting cat? I carry it all the time. Sure, because people need proof all the time, <laughs> evidently. You can look at the magazine, Masala magazine. It's all I've been doing. Like, that's yes. all I've been doing. Yeah. This is my card. Convinced? Fine. You have an honest face, yes. so I'll go with it. Thank you, I'm honored. Mm -hmm. I remember the time when, you know, Kuch Kuch Hota Hai was the rage. That's right. right, that's right, yeah. And it was also, I belong to the era when Shah Rukh Khan with his outstretched arms was the most romantic thing that I've ever seen. But to be fair, he does that in a lot of movies even today. Yeah, but when he started doing that, and yeah. it was the most romantic. Yeah. That, I, I concur. That means you're the 90s girl. <laughs> I am. So how about reliving the 90s today? For I mean, millennials no. who don't know what it is. Cool. Normally I try to forget it. Really. Like, huh? But for you, I will re-remember anything. Absolutely. So let's have an infotainment class for the millennials. Yes. 90s for the millennials. Curtsy Lola Kuti. Curtsy Anu Menon. Yes. So Anu, so this is what we'll do. I'll give you a few words that belong to the 90s. Okay. And we're going to relive our era. Sure. Okay. Okay. Just one I just need a preparatory song. Ooga shaka, ooga shaka, ooga. Yeah, okay. Kumar Shanu and Alka Yagnik. Oh, I much prefer Anuradha Podwar. <laughs> I have to say, you know, so musical. That's true. Just anybody, I, I don't know, is Kumar Shanu still alive? God, he's alive and kicking. I thought he would have died while listening to his own song. <laughs> no. Cut! Channel B and MTV. Well, Channel B is officially dead. So, uh, but the, honestly, when people say, uh, "Hey, you're that Lola from MTV," you no, know, I just say yes because MTV was a superior channel. So, you know, facts are facts. Shah Rukh Khan. So, I love Shah Rukh Khan in Bajigar. My favorite. Like, I think he I made so. Bad so good. Yes. So every time I would like, I wear lenses today. I still think of him. <laughs> you know. <laughs> kuch kuch hota hai. Kuch kuch hota hai. No, it didn't. Uh, it didn't work for me. Because I just think, did you not have an issue with him just using Kajol as a convenience? And I why was she playing basketball in a sari after she was a tomboy for all those years? Like, I'm really mad. It gets me very emotional. Like, You're thinking on a feminist point of view from 2018. We're going back to the 90s and then we didn't question all these things. I was a feminist even then. Like, huh? Not me too. Karan Johar. Karan Johar is, uh, is a, what, 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 like he can do anything. Which is, I think, great. And also, he has an office in Bombay, which is apparently 32,000 square wow. feet. That's very rich. I mean, even Mukesh is like, whoa! Mukesh, <laughs> that's impressive. Ambani, your of friend. Of course, of course. Mukesh Bhai. Yeah, Mukesh Bhai. We live and on the same street, guys. Yes. Uh, Baba Cycle. Baba Cycle was the bomb. So, he is, I suppose, the. Like, Baba Cycle had thanda thanda pani, and uh, Honey Singh has blue hai pani pani pani. So, you can see, like, lyrics haven't changed much. Internet with dial up connection. <laughs> So, did you were you ever on ICQ? No, I wasn't. Oh my god, yeah, I used to be on ICQ. No. Yeah, so oh. I used to be on ICQ and there was this guy in America, this Malayali boy, uh, very sweet but deathly boring. Okay, so in which my family is like, oh, Malayali, Malayali mm -hmm. and all. And then he used to just say the most random things on ICQ. Like, can I can I kiss you but after eating chocolate? And I was like, you are America. I dial up connection. <laughs> Or could? Never. No, no, just no. No. Did I say no? I, I meant it. No. Hmm. Like, eh, no. Just no. Just, I can keep saying this all day, guys. Uh, Sachin Tendulkar and Shahid Apredi. So, 
I mean, you can't say Shahid Afridi is a nice because Shahid Afridi has been 16 since the day he was born, right? right. Shahid Afridi is still 16. He made his debut at 16. He retired at 16, 16 also, 16. right? So, and his kids are also possibly 16. <laughs> I don't know. Or maybe they're just a thought in his head yeah. at this point. Who knows? Um, and But Sachin actually looks 16. Yes. So, one can't say. But my favorite was Rahul Dravid. Of course. Something like Sachin is, I mean, Tingu. But like, lovely. But Dravid was the man for me. Indie pop. I love, did you love Shweta Shetty? Oh yes. Oh my gosh, my favorite. And uh, Alisha Chinai was Baby, made in India yeah, with Milan Milan Soman. Soman. Okay, see, we both spoke oh at the God. same time. And that Shweta Shetty, because she had curly hair. Yes. And uh, she's like, Johnny, Johnny, Joker, Divana, Mastana. I, I saw her the other day and I was like, oh my God, I'm like a fan now? moment. <laughs> then I saw this guy, uh, Uday Benegal from India oh, Screen. Yes. And I was like, I'm so excited. And my friend's like, who is this person? And I was like, you will never understand. <laughs> 90s kids, see yeah. that's what. <laughs> yeah. Boy bands. Boy bands. So I used to love Boy Zone more than yes. Backstreet Boys. Okay, I was a Backstreet Boys girl. Uh -huh. mm. So then I wanted Boy Zone back. What's I didn't want the Backstreets back. It, it, I was like, no, just no. Okay. Valentine's Day. Valentine's. I I'm just not a believer in Valentine's Day. But it was such a big thing in the 90s. Yeah, I went on like one Valentine's Day date and it was just awkward and it was. And th you know, there's too much love I can't handle. This mush. I just, it's like death by hearts. Mm. It's, you know, nothing's gonna end my love for you. Like every like Archie's outlet. Yes. Yeah, Archie's and Hallmark. Dirty team, love music lady and where stop it. <laughs> So, yeah, and then like you can't be romantic over Mexican food, right? Like, that's what you could afford the chance. Yes. So, like over tacos, I love you, no. no. It's, it's... Friends and sex in the city. Uh, friends over sex in the city, yeah. Because I was just like, what are these outfits in Sex in the City at one point? Like, they all look like they're Shavagdava dancers and they're going to, you know, do some, like, what, what is going on? It's like an annual day function, right. like every day. Uh, it, was, it was overload, it was an overload. So, friends. Thank yeah. you, Arun. Thank you so much. This Thank was so much fun. Going um, back in time. <laughs>